Hello and welcome to 3D Print Passion. Today I like to check out the different options for surfaces to have nicer prints in Cura. The first thing I did is I made a standard print. The first one is a cylinder and the second one is a square. Usually I print my surfaces with the line option in Cura and under normal circumstances that's for me absolutely okay. The surfaces will be a little bit rough but for normal 3D prints at my opinion it's absolutely okay. Uh, I show you here now the options, how I have printed it and I will always show you a quick view in Cura that you can see what I have set up and afterwise I will give you a little close-up and to have a better look and view of the produced surfaces. Yeah, like you can see here in the close-up view uh, you see the typically surfaces from a 3D print which are a little bit rough like I already said but still okay for normal circumstances. The second one I have done as a test print was a concentric option to set up in Kiora. And you see that the surface is now much more smoother and see also the reflections of that surface. It's really beautiful that concentric setting for the surfaces because it gives you, like I said, a much smoother surface and depending to my PLA I have used here, which is a high reflecting PLA, you have uh, a beautiful surface, which is really reflecting very, very nice. The third surface settings I have tested is the zigzag mode. And we see here already that, uh, at my opinion at least, the different between the line mode and the zigzag mode is not really visible at my opinion but what I had as an issue you see it here in the close-up view that my surface was in one corner not completely closed and I think that's um, a problem depending to the low infill I have used and so the nozzle was not able to uh, fill up the surface completely nice. So to be honest I don't use zigzag mode normally. Like I said in the beginning I use usually my line mode settings and with that uh, I am absolutely happy. And what we see here is like I already said I cannot see a big difference between line and zigzag means if you prefer line use the line mode if you prefer zigzag take the zigzag mode the visible result is very very near to each other next one i was choosing the uh, concentric mode with ironing and you see here now really a very very smooth surface yeah and you can see here where the nozzle was lifting up so you feel it really with the fingers and I think I was leveling my bed a little bit too close too deep and uh, that's the reason why I have now that uh, yeah that little dot in the middle of the print uh, not very nice but that it's very easy to fix with some slicer corrections and with a little bit higher bed distance. My next test was zigzag and ironing and we will have a look to that surface now. And I was really surprised because this kind of surface functions it's really unbelievable flat. You can feel it with your fingers. It's so smooth you can't see anymore any lines and you see it here hopefully in the close-up that 
more or less not really visible anymore that this is a 3D print on the surface. It's absolutely smooth. Beautiful print and a very nice function to play a little bit around with it and to, to collect some experiences with it. And depending on the 3D print you like to do, maybe it could be really, really very interesting to test that function for yourself and to see how to uh, improve your 3D print. Yeah, let's have a compare to the yeah, standard line surface function um, to the zigzag ironing function. And I made a little photo because with the video function I cannot catch up that with high enough quality. And we will directly compare that. And yeah, see on the left side the standard line settings and on the right side the zigzag ironing function. That's really unbelievable, isn't it? The difference is so great and beautiful that uh, I really need to use that ironing function with zigzag in future much, much more. My last test print I have done with the fuzzy skin mode. You can find it in the experimental functions. And with that fuzzy skin, you can really make some beautiful walls on your object and have a look to it. How the look of that objects have been changed by that fuzzy mode function. At my opinion, it looks really beautiful. You can give your objects uh, by that way a more natural look not so 3D printed like, and especially for handles and things like that, I think it's really a beautiful function to use and I really need to do in future um, a big handle with that function. And I will show you in the video maybe somewhere in future. Let's compare quickly my test prints. You see on the first one, the line mode surfaces, um, which are standard in Cura, uh, in compare with the zigzag surface function and we talked already about it at my opinion you don't see a difference you have on the next close-up the concentric ironing mode which was really beautiful with a smooth surface but the nicest one in my opinion on the surface mode function was the zigzag ironing mode which gives really an unbelievable smooth surface which is absolutely beautiful and don't look really like a 3D print anymore. And at least on the sixth test print the experimental fuzzy skin mode to change the wall of your object and to have a little bit more natural look which is also very nice. Yeah, thank you for watching the video. If you like it, please give me a thumbs up. Give me some comments uh, below the video um, what your experiences are with that function. Thank you very much and happy printing. Bye bye.